And welcome to Morton High Governor News for Tuesday, November 1st, 2016. I'm Danielle Usinger. And I'm Susan Hale. Will everyone please stand and join us for the Pledge of Allegiance? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Fall sports banquet will be on Thursday, November 3rd, in the Morton High School cafeteria starting at 6.30. We will provide soda, water, coffee, and a sheet cake. Fall athletes, please bring a dessert. Any questions, see Ms. Lucan. Winter formal is back. The senior class is hosting it on January 13th, 2017. All Morton students are invited to attend. The dance will take place in our cafeteria, which will be transformed into a winter dream for the occasion. Applications are available in the office and room 247 and are due Tuesday, November 22nd, the day before Thanksgiving break. Tickets will be $10 each and only students with an application on file will be able to purchase a ticket. Non-Morton students may attend, but there is a separate application. Please see Ms. Lakin in room 247 for any question. Governors, don't forget the free tutoring is available in the library every Tuesday and Thursday after school from 2.30 until 4.30. You can get help with homework, preparing for a big test, and use the computers for Play-Doh or to finish an assignment. Teachers are available to help. The credit union will be in the cafeteria on Tuesday and Thursday during your lunch period. Did you know you can open a savings account for just $1 and start earning interest? Stop by the credit union and talk to a representative about all your financial needs. Start saving today. Juniors, interested in buying junior class t-shirts? Money and orders forms are due today to Miss Miss or Miss Taylor. If you need an order form, please see Miss Miss in room 125. Parent teacher conferences will be held on Wednesday, November 2nd from 5.30 to 6.45 in the cafeteria. Students who will attend conferences will be given their first quarter report cards. This is a wonderful opportunity to discuss your grades with your teachers. Do you like to sing and want to be part of the Morton High School Musical this year? Then come to the Pit Choir. Call-out meeting is Wednesday, November 2nd at 3.30 in the choir room, room 316. Ms. Pruitt Alley will go over the expectations and obligations for the choir, as well as the calendar of rehearsals that will be after school for Scrooge. You do not have to be a vocal major or half a student to participate. Anyone is welcome to the meeting November 2nd at 3.30. Juniors, please be sure to check your school email account to find out if you must take the AccuPlacer assessment November 9th and 10th. 10th. Find more details about your exact time to test in your school email. If you have any questions, please see Mr. Danko or your counselor. The Morton High School dance team is selling spirit wear from November 7th through 21st. We have a variety of t-shirts, fleece wear, sweatshirts, sweatpants, stocking caps, and headbands. See any of the Morton dance team members to place your order. Don't miss out on these great spirit items. All orders and payments due by November 21st. Thank you for supporting your Morton dance team. Here are the names of governors who have a birthday this week. Make sure to help them celebrate by wishing them a happy birthday. Lunch options today include nacho grande, popcorn chicken and mashed potato bowl, turkey, ham, and cheese on pretzel bun, spicy chicken wrap, cheese personal pan pizza, chopped salad with turkey, and a yogurt box. That's all the news for today. Remember, you can always watch the news straight from the Morton High webpage. Thanks for watching and have a great day.